doesn't qualify for an H-1B visa, then what other visas can they apply for? Well, I would like to clarify that people often think that H-1B is the answer to all nurse, um, uh, um, you know, all the nurses who are seeking to move to the United States. The fact of the matter is that USCIS is not very liberal with issuing H-1Bs to nurses unless they are in very specific categories. So it's not just enough to be a registered nurse in order to apply for an H-1B. You need to be a specialized nurse for somebody who's working, let's say, in, in the uh, critical care unit or in the oncology department or the cardiology department or the emergency room or whatnot. So you need to belong to one of those uh, nursing um, areas in order to be able to qualify for an H-1B in the first place. If you were just a regular uh, registered nurse, um, and are not a nurse practitioner or similar, then you will not even qualify for an H-1B. So that being said, uh, a couple of other options that nurses can consider to uh, move to the United States if they have an employer. For example, if the, if the country of nationality of a nurse is Canada or Mexico, they can apply for a TN visa through their employer. Um, there, which is available to nurses. But remember, any foreign nurse who has not completed their education in the United States will need to get a visa screen uh, by the CGFMS in order to confirm that their uh, nursing degree or nursing credentials are the equivalent of a U.S. Nursing, de nursing degree. Because if that visa screen is not met or not obtained prior to applying for the visa, they do not qualify for that visa at all. The other part of it is that there are many employers who reach out to us asking us to apply for nurse, nurse, uh, nurses for their green cards, especially if they're from countries like the Philippines or, um, let's say, India um, or, you know, the Bahamas or Jamaica or any other country that they have candidates from. Now, India being the exception here because of the long wait periods for uh, the priority date to become current, in most other countries, when people employ, apply for nurses, they are able to bring nurses within a period of about three years under the EB3 or the EB2 category, depending on whether the nurse has a, a master's degree in nursing or a bachelor's degree in nursing plus five years of relevant experience. Again, visa screen is critical in this regard. You cannot get any visa approved in the United States to start working here if you have a foreign nursing degree unless your visa has been completed by the CGFNS.